good morning hi everyone welcome back to my channel i know it's been a while but yeah i've just been going through some things but i'm back with another video the sun is actually really irritating me and i don't know of another place where i can record my video but okay anyways so this video is about my favorite curls at the moment and that has to be my roller set curls guys yo those curls are delicious and i just want to share with you guys exactly how i achieve those beautiful delicious curls so yeah um if you follow me ugh, i can't even say if you follow me on instagram because my account was hacked but anyways yeah um i have a new account guys my account um nina underscore underscore x was um hacked last week sunday and i don't have like there's no luck trying to get my account back guys i was just almost this close 50,000 followers but okay I don't like speaking about this anymore because every time I do I get like really sad I don't want to be sad no more we gotta move on we gotta keep going right so yeah I started a new YouTube um, I said YouTube I started a new Instagram um, page it's still Nuna but it has three underscores X I'll put it down here some of you guys um, if you could just follow me on my new Instagram page, I would really love and appreciate that. I'm trying to get back to 40,000 followers. Anyways, let's get moving. Um, I had a protective hairstyle for the past two weeks. And it's nothing, it was nothing new. But my mother, my mother did it for me. Um, this is what I did. yeah as you can see it's a very nice protective hairstyle i used to do that every time when i was in school like every sunday i remember every sunday my mother washes my hair and she plaits it for school on monday and i used to hate it so much and now i'm like mommy please do my hair <coughs> weird but yeah so that was my protective hairstyle um i think it did my hair quite good because the weather has been oh it's been extremely cold guys like extremely cold in secunda yo so what i would do is i would oil my scalp at night wash my edges and then put my satin bonnet actually i bought a do-rag sorry i bought a do-rag so that works like much better than a satin bonnet when you have such a flat protective hairstyle so yeah that really helped me and then i went to sleep with it every night that's why I could, it could actually last me like two weeks because my hair looked really neat um and then when i go to work i just put on my my durag and then i put on a cuppy because it's like super cold and yeah now and then i would just leave it out like just the way it is i would just do my edges and then wash my edges at night every time you know so yeah that's what's been going on with my hair for the past two weeks and i took out my protective hairstyle last night and this is how my hair looks yeah um what i did notice is my ends my ends gotta go like it gotta go I know that my hair grew so much and I was speaking to my mother about it last night. My hair grew so 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 much. Look at this. Look at how long this is. And now I have to cut it. And I noticed that it's actually a lot of hair that I have to cut because my ends are really really dry. And at the end of the day, it is health over length. Okay. 
so it's no use you have long hair when it's not healthy you understand so yeah okay so what i'm gonna do today like now is i'm gonna do an oil treatment because i feel like my hair needs some extra love and care right now since it's been in that protective hairstyle for two weeks so we just need some extra some extra love um i'm gonna use these product okay for my oil treatment what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna mix my olive oil there's not a lot of it in so it's like it's like just so little i'm gonna mix my extra virgin olive oil and my sweet almond oil this there's still enough of it in here so i'm gonna mix that and then lastly i'm gonna use the perfect hair grow on the go hair growth oil i love this because it has basil in it basil root oil and this is for growth so yeah i'm gonna mix these three up i'm gonna put it in a bowl with hot water and i'm just gonna warm it up and I'm going to put it on my hair. Okay, but I'm going to show you guys everything. So, yeah, let me go. Oh, yeah. Also, I'm going to use my K2 hair, hair, hair treatment oil. Um, I'm going to add a few drops of these, this oil. Sorry. This oil into my mixture for my hot oil treatment. This is how it looks. And I absolutely love this oil. So, yeah. Let me get started. Back. Okay, so I have this jug with boiling hot water. Ugh, no. Sorry about that. And then I have this, this um, let's call it an applicator. I bought this at Clicks. It had the original therapy Jamaican black castor stimulating growth oil in it. But this is finished now. So I'm just gonna use this to put all the all blah, to put all the oils together. And then apply it to my hair because it has this Kasai Heels thingy. So this makes it easy. <sighs> Why am I so tired now? Alrighty. So we'll start with the olive oil. My dog is so crazy. He's just running around like a mad thing. Just gonna put all this olive oil in here. I need to go and buy new go buy another bottle of this olive oil but this is quite expensive hey like this oil hmm. and then i'm gonna put some of this this um grow on the go hair oil add some of it to that i don't want to finish this oil because i love this oil so much guys yo Then the hair treatment oil from Key2. Just gonna put some of that in there. I love the, what I love about this. Sorry, this Key2 oil is that it has peppermint oil in it, and my hair absolutely, absolutely loves peppermint oil. Especially my scalp feels like it's breathing. And then lastly, I'm going to put the sweet almond oil into this. I always just put this thing in like this and I just leave it. So I'm just going to leave it like this so it can drop. The, oil, the drops can just fall in there because it takes forever. Okay, so I think that is enough now. And then I'm just going to mix it all up. Okay, so now once that it's all mixed up, I put it in this hot water and I'm just gonna let it warm up like this while I section my hair. Oh, 
okay so my oil is hot i just don't want it to be too hot so i'm just gonna push it and taste it okay sorry for my language it feels just about right Okay, so I kept the hooded dryer on my head for about 20 minutes and I'm gonna rinse this off now and shampoo and conditioner and whatever so I'm gonna show you guys the process again because like I haven't done a updated wash day video in a very long time so this is the updated wash day video FT roller set curls, okay? Let's get it. <laughs> okay, please don't mind my outfit. Um, this is with the oil on my hair. As you can see, my ends are super, super, super dry. But my mom is gonna sort me out with that. But yeah, I'm gonna rinse this off now. So yeah. I just rinsed off my shampoo. Um, I used the shampoo twice because that's what it says on the directions. So yeah, I think my scalp is all clean now. Now I will be using the Perfect Car Wash Creamy Cleanser, a sulfate free creamy conditioner cleanser, okay? I'll be using this. Right, so I just rinsed off the cold cleanser conditioner from the, um, the perfect hair. This is the one I used. I just rinsed it off, didn't keep it on for 
for long at all so now what i'll be using is my favorite deep conditioner f2 so yeah i'm gonna use this and i'm first gonna spray my hair with this um in here i have pure water with a few drops of almond oil so yeah let's get it 